decided to do something a little bit different for my walking and talking today. Thursday, 7 December 2023. It's raining outside. I'm Tans Corley, Leonardo, and this is my YouTube channel, Tans Leonardo. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to pace around inside the house and talk. So, this is my bed. <laughs> Evidently, Hungarians have it. Well, my who am I wedding? So, I'm not pacing, am I? Okay. I'm pacing the hallway as I speak. So, it, with Hungarian culture, it, supposedly, the man sleeps alone the night before the wedding. So, if that's true, Dominique Sabosvai would commandeer my bed the night before the wedding. Like, so after the rehearsals and stuff, and like after the proposal, so if that's the same day, then he could sleep there and if he could have the whole room to himself if. The guest list is currently at like 26, and Vlad Stanky is like the disc jockey music man kind of thing. Uh, but since there's not a disc, it's not, I'll keep moving. Music man. I want to keep the name of this video accurate, walking and talking, you know. I was, I'm walking backwards. Okay, so he would, <laughs> we're going to do a glancing view. So he would sleep there. And then we could have, so if we're moving my stuff out... Like, this will be gone. That might be folded out. This might be up against the wall. This stuff might be gone. Could fit, like, eight people in this room. So eight, nine, do two in that room. Ten, eleven. Not everybody's overnight guests. Um, but then me and Jacob. Me and Ed. I don't know. Whoever Dominique wants me to be with that night. And then... If he doesn't get me that night, but he gets me then the wedding night. So there's that. So that'd be like, what if we had eight people there, one person there, two people there, eight plus one, nine plus two, eleven, and we have twenty six people. Um, subtracting out my sister and brother in law who probably want to spend the night, and aunt in it, and grandma Connie who probably want to spend the night. We're down to twenty two. My parents and Connie sleep in one room, so we're down to nineteen. To be accounted for and we already have 11 so that leaves us eight more people to put in places put two in the guest room maybe uh dominique's dad and his plus one orsi and then so we're, we're we have 19 minus 11 so eight two so we have six left and do six out here or do six upstairs and eight down here there's plenty of space. Hypothetically, if my parents were all right with it. All right. Okay, so that's wedding planning of like where everybody would be if they spend the night. And then the wedding ceremony here. Where would I put this? Classify this. I guess this is talking about. I'm going to do the wedding ceremony if I'm classifying it. There's Con and Dog. Hi, Dad! Potential ring bearer. There's the, so we'll classify this as wedding ceremony I'm talking about. And then let's talk about something more moving related. What are my family dynamics going to be like when I, after I move out and if I move in with my soulmate and or soulmates. So if I move in with my soulmate and or soulmates, my mom is a bit of a Mrs. Bennett type from Pride and Prejudice in the sense of horrified, mortified about the daughter moving out. Um, my mom does take it a little bit further and she kind of like sometimes is like, who are you to my bed? Um, sometimes it feels like she's faking, sometimes it doesn't. So she might do that to me. So like, for all I know, I move out and then my mom says, I don't have a daughter named Tannis. I would classify that per her current actions and actions over the past few months is that is probably 100% likely to happen at least once. <laughs> so I might not talk to my mom, period. Like, she doesn't even know who I am. There's, I'm not gonna spend the rest of my life, right? Um, initiating conversations that won't be reciprocated anyway. So there's that one. Kona, I don't know. Will dad come and visit me? Will Kona come and visit me? Will we come back and visit? If I go into modeling and I need a bunch of clothes and like wherever I'm living, I don't have any places or know any places to get clothes, I might come back and do some shopping at places where I've gotten clothes before um, just to kind of get me launched in my modeling career. So there's, um, I guess I'm trying to say is there's family visits and there's holidays and stuff like that, which my sister actually, when she got together with her fiance and husband and stuff, they actually spent it apart from the rest of us. So 
I would anticipate my family being okay with that for me and my soulmates as well. Um, but also thinking, is there, if there's the professional opportunity to come back and be in the area and drop by and stuff, um, working family visits in that way kind of thing. Yeah. Uh, my step aunt Jan and uncle Gordy don't talk to me period. So I don't anticipate that changing. Um, I don't know. It's a family dynamics are a little bit, it, it might be a quieting of communications for a while. It's us newlyweds, you kind of used to having each other and getting settled down and stuff like that. Kind of like my sister got, um, kind of thing. And getting in, new interactions figured out. So maybe that's the way, best way of phrasing it is fine. Family dynamics would be a bit, um, figuring it out. New chapter of my life in a big way. So no rush on a longer term interaction frequency or solution kind of thing. Yeah. But yeah, it's my walking and talking today, Thursday, 7 December 2023, and that's kind of dog.